So in a game like this, we all were able to get it in hand pretty early on, and some of the backups were able to get some playing time. How important are those games for you guys to not just go and practice against some of these good players, but get a lot of game experience on the field? Yeah, I think it's, it's huge, especially for Tyson, the younger quarterback. Um, I know last year for me, getting in these games, um, it just builds confidence, and, and you can look at what you did on film, not you know somebody else and trying to learn from that. You can actually look from what you did and build on that, get get critique, get coached, um, and then come back the next week and try not to do the same mistake. Um, you know, Tyson and, and Chez and them young backs, them young receivers, they're you know they're going to build off this game, um, and then hopefully you know in, in the next next rest of the season we get more games like this where you know we just come out hitting all cylinders and then we get those guys an opportunity to play i know you guys prepare for each team the same but after opening up against three straight power five opponents did it feel nice to have a little bit of a, of a catch of breath i guess against a group of five and a little bit of an easier test today um we practiced the same like you know we were playing south carolina or florida state um the week you know same monday time same tuesday wednesday thursday the same preparation so um, we went into the game just expecting a dogfight. They were, I think, seventh in the country in, uh, in rushing. Um, they were scoring about 47 points a game. So um, we knew we had a, a tough task on our hands. We didn't want to let it go early when we get on top. Um, what does it say just about the depth of this team, that when you guys put in second string, third string, do you, do you guys, they're still going out and dominating mm -hmm. these games? Yeah, we're strong. Our, our back end is strong, and we're excited for it. Do the cadence count, the C-L-E-M-S. What goes through your mind? Um, I started doing it with them a little bit. Uh, it's fun just seeing all the fans, um, Tiger Walk, seeing everybody fired up, you know, knowing that um, it is a, what, a group of five. It's, it's not a power five team, but they're still here ready to see us play, and they're expecting us to play at a standard, um, at the Clemson standard, and just excel. And so to put on performance and then hear them chant and cheer, it's just it's, re it's rewarding. What's your mentality when you go into the game? 17 up, 24 up, 31 up, whatever it was, to make sure that you play at the level that is expected. Yeah, I think it's just not trying to do too much and do, you know, play the play and whatever the defense gives you, you execute the play how it's supposed to be executed. And, uh, you know, when you start trying to do too much, you start psyching yourself out, you start second guessing and throwing the ball or, or pulling it when you don't need to and start forcing things. So, um, you know, and I ask, I ask Trevor, I ask uh, Tyson, what he's seeing, um, Ben on the bench, like what are you seeing that maybe I didn't see? You know, just so the next drive we can we can be better. Here's the last two guys today, Chase.